Hi everybody. Today we're going to learn how to make big my mom's big ziti. Woohoo! Um, first you uh, boil a pot of water, and mm -hmm. while that's doing, while that's boiling, we are going to brown the meat. Yep. And then once the water boils and bubbles, we're going to do what? Put in the noodles so that they can soften. So they can soften, and then we'll strain the ground beef to get all the extra juices out. <laughs> Here, I'll take that. Scared me. You're good. Wait, can I switch this around? Yep. Okay, I'm sorry. Go ahead. Gotta mush it up to like... Real up. quick, while you're doing this, I want you to What's reach it? up, hit bake, because we're gonna preheat our oven, mm -hmm. and hit start. We're preheating at 350. This looks like baby food. <laughs> Go ahead. Adding a little salt to the water. Helps the noodles sticking. How much salt do I put? A little bit more. There you go. That's good. Oh, that's hot. Yeah, that's hot. All right. You stir your meat up a little bit more? Yeah. Now, once it's done browning, which it's almost done, what do we do next? Do you know? We put it in the um, strainer? strainer so that we can get the juice thing out. Good job. Pay attention to what you're doing very carefully. Yep. And you're going to take mm. it. Got it? Yeah, this is heavy though. Yes, it is. It's a cast iron skillet. And then you just dump all of it right in. It smells like bacon. It smells like bacon. Just be careful Ow. the pot's hot. I'll take it. Got it? And then you can just set the pot off to the side right here. Hold it, like. It'll be fine. There we go. Should I put water on it? Yes. Just set those right there. What do I say? Just put it in. That's all you gotta do. <laughs> you don't have to say anything. It's okay. Just jump all the way in. Keep going. Now we're just going to let that do what? Boil. Boil and get soft again? Yep. All right. Go ahead. Be, sure, be sure to mix your noodles every now and then so they don't stick together. Good job. The Go for noodles it. are ready. So we're going to strain it. Got it? Oh, it's like really heavy. Look up so you don't see in your glasses. There you go. That's where you got the thing. Yep. You can't see. You're good. They could be blind. <laughs> Hot. Got it all? No. Okay. Now we're it's gonna... still not all coming out. That's all right. Just put the pot back on the si on the stove. There's only one like, one noodle. It's lonely. Okay. It's a lonely <laughs> noodle. So what we're going to do now is we're going to take our noodles and put it in the pot. Back in the pot. If it doesn't get everything, where else? Carefully. Then we're oh. gonna recover the, some of the runaway noodles. Oh. It's okay, I got pinchers. And then, we put the beet inside. I'm scared I'm gonna get this out of here. Hold on. Here. It can be a little tricky. It actually kind of scared me a little bit. You're good. All right, and then. Wow, you're flinging it everywhere. It likes to fly. Okay. And then after we do that, you can just put that back in the sink. All right, so now, Evelyn, what are we doing now? We put the sauce in. The sauce in the pot. Sauce. Sauce in the pot. Hold on. I don't want it to go. Just tilt it. All right. Shh. You have one can. Here, you want the other? Yeah. Here's the other. Careful. Here, oh. Just tilt it up. All right, and then we're going to. Get spoon. 
get a spoon, make a lot of noise, scare the dogs. And we're going to we'll do what? No, that we're not going to tap it. We're going to stir it and mix it all together. This is hot. Yeah, that's really hot. <laughs> what? This is your, that was the oven. You're fine. Oh, I thought it turned on on me. It scared me. No, the, the stove didn't turn on. Sometimes you gotta kind of scoop. That's what I'm doing. This looks like SpaghettiOs. It's not SpaghettiOs, I promise. It'll taste a thousand times better than SpaghettiOs. How many times have you had this? I don't know. A lot. Christmas is all over the time. Sometimes not during Christmas. Sometimes not during Christmas. Magic, who knew? That was difficult. Really. So now, as you can see, I have a bag of cheese. And we're going to dump the whole thing in here. And then we're going to stir it again. We really like stirring things. Got my special spoon. Yep. We have our commentary. Get it out. Flip that meat. There you go. <laughs> we got this. This is difficult. Yes, it is. All right, now what are we doing? Okay, so first, let's admire my new spoon to scoop it. But now we um, scoop the baked ziti into this. Yeah. Now Pain. we've blended the meat, the sauce, the noodles, the cheese, and we're all we're gonna put it in this tray. I look like a, like a cafeteria girl, like, and then you just like they can get like their thing, and then they just plop it in there. Okay, well don't make a huge mess and splatter it everywhere while okay. you're being a cafeteria girl. <laughs> man, I miss my cafeteria teachers. Man. You miss good. your cafeteria? Yeah, and lambs, they're actually really nice. Oh. You could bleep that. Up. <laughs> Oof. All right, now we'll just oh, okay. Got that? I wonder how many people actually do cooking. I don't know. All right, now spread it out. Oh, it's not done yet. It's not done. No, no. Let me get the rest of that. Okay, I'm good now. Now we spread it like I've been doing kind of this whole time, but now we have to. This is a big spreading wheel. Mm -hmm. If none of the noodles want to come out in the process, okay. I'll take We're this, gonna... and then you're gonna spread the cheese. So, you see this cheese? It's gonna go, you're gonna grab it like this, and then you're gonna sprinkle it on top. And it's okay if it clumps a little bit. It's okay. It's okay. You're going to make a nice, not too thick layer, but make sure you can't really see it too much of fun. There's another bag of cheese for you. Oh, okay. I was about to say, I didn't know. <laughs> You're going to need more cheese. It's okay. Don't you need at least, like, almost two bags of cheese? I end up using usually about three, two and a half to three bags. This is your second bag of cheese. It's in the corner for some reason. All right. Go for it. Like a clump player, it scared me. Mm. I was like, am I grabbing cheese? Or am I grabbing clumps? Go all the way to the edge. There you go. <gasps> <laughs> Whoops. Oh, 
Oh no. Hmm. Did you see Miss Waters in TikTok? The TikTok thing that she said? I have not seen her written latest TikTok. No, 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 no. Okay, so it was, um, she was cleaning her house and it was really funny. In her like, wedding dress? Yeah. Yeah, you showed me. And then she sent it to me too. I like it. Because you mentioned it. She did really good. She did great. It was awesome. It was awesome. All right, I think that's plenty. Gonna that's have really a nice good. top layer. Is that good? He's getting her gloves on. Mm. Got it? This you might, you might not need the gloves. Okay, actually, okay, okay. Because okay. just don't touch the tray. Oh. Is that better? No, it's still like really, really. Oh well, yeah, it's heavy. <laughs> don't hurt yourself on the oven door. Almost did that. Slide it all the way in. Okay, let's go. Alright, just close the oven. Now we're gonna bake it till when? It's done. <laughs> Until it's done. Mm -hmm. About 20 to 30 minutes. And we can tell it's done by the fact that the cheese is melted and crispy and brown. It's browned, yes. Not black, light brown, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> Evelyn. Light brown. I'm sorry. All right, hey, Skylar. It's the time you've all been waiting for. The food is done. Now we gotta take it out carefully. Out. Burps. Without dying. <laughs> Up on the oven. And we have. Oh. Evelyn's completed baked ziti and her garlic bread. She did it. See? Mom, I've learned.